Hi there. In this tutorial, we'll explain how to install your Hydra Oxygen machine. We're going to install the different handles on one side of the machine and then on the other. Radio frequency. First, plug the radio frequency handle connector to the socket that says RF. Press it to screw it tight. Second, plug the cold hammer connector to the socket that says cold. Press it and screw it tight. For the spray gun, plug its connector to the outlet that says spray. Once the connector has been fastened, fill the vial with the serum or solution of your choice and attach it to the sprayer, making a little pressure. On the other side of the machine, you'll see three more sockets. Plug the cavitation connector into the socket that says ultrasound. Press it and screw it tight. Now's the turn of the skin scrubber, which is protected by a cover you must remove before using it. Plug the connector to the socket that says scrubber and adjust it to make sure it doesn't move. As for the abrasion handle, before connecting it, we must assemble it. Attach a filter to it as well as the tip we want to use. First, attach the roll filter to the top of the abrasion pen and then do the same with the tip you'd like to use. There are six different types which can all be used for all skin types. Choose the one that best adapts to your preferences and press it tight. Once the handle is assembled, plug the abrasion connector into the socket that says abrasion. Press it and screw it tight. Now's the turn of the LED mask. To connect it, insert the connector into the socket behind the LED screen and adjust it. And that's it! All our accessories have been installed. The next step is not compulsory, but may help you have your LED mask more at hand. If you want to attach the mask holder onto the machine, you will need a Phillips screwdriver. Use it to remove the two bolts that fasten the handles holder on one side and attach it to the machine and the handles holder. Last, connect the machine to power. Next to the power switch, there is a socket where you must connect the male plug. Then connect the other end of the cable to the nearest socket. Press the start button and your machine is ready to use.